from a station working for you. This is a WRTV update. And I'm Lauren Casey. Here are your latest headlines. New this morning, Apple is setting up shop in Hendricks County, bringing hundreds of new jobs. The tech company has opened a state-of-the-art distribution center in Clayton. The $100 million facility will bring 500 jobs by 2024. XPO Logistics will operate the facility. Apple executives say the Hendricks County facility will help U.S. customers get products faster. XPO is already hiring for this facility. This morning, IU and the city of Bloomington are turning to the public to help rename a major street across the campus. Officials are looking to rename Jordan Avenue, named after David Starr Jordan, IU's president from 1885 to 1891. Jordan was a proponent of selective breeding. Bloomington residents can propose alternative street names online. IU recently stripped Jordan's name from a university building, parking garage, and river. The State Department of Health is asking vaccine clinics to begin accepting walk-ins, and they want that to start as early as today. That means pre-scheduled appointments are not required anymore. Some clinics, however, are fully booked. They will not be able to make that transition immediately. If you'd like to schedule an appointment, you can still do so at our shop.in.gov, or you can call 211. Let's get a check of our forecast right now with meteorologist Todd Clausen. And Lauren, temperatures today back above a normal with sunny skies. Should be a beautiful day for us all across the area with highs that will be generally right around the 75 degrees this evening will cool off into the 60s, but look at your overnight lows much warmer than they have been as you wake up on Tuesday morning we will be in the upper 50s to even low 60s with partly cloudy skies. It does get a little windy overnight and that carries into your day tomorrow, but tomorrow high temperatures all the way up into the low 80s. The record high is 84. We'll get very close to that, Lauren, in some areas by Tuesday afternoon. Todd, thank you. For more stories and weather you need to know, just download the WRTV mobile app. Thanks for joining us.